Those are a lot of mouths to feed. Feline mouths, I should say. More wet food for our hybrid cats below. And the slam and pounding of a caretaker prepping food for uh, two of our largest tigers here at the Wildcat Sanctuary. Welcome everyone. Happy Friday here. That's Mr. AJ doing some uh, food prep for Caesar and Logan. We're going to take you guys down to Feline Meadows after we hang out in our prep, uh, our prep room here and speak to AJ about kind of some of the things that go into caring for a tiger, specifically their diet. And uh, yeah, we're going to Get uh, the scoop from AJ and kind of celebrate Tigerthon the second day here. Always love showing everyone uh, the diet board. That's about a five foot tall uh, whiteboard that's chock full of uh, diets for our 100 plus cats here at the Wildcat Sanctuary. And uh, you can see the amount of detail for each cat. We have little kind of notes written by them as well. And then I look behind one of our interns over here and that's not just, uh, that's not all the cats. That is the DAC, uh, Hybrid Haven, excuse me. AJ, thank you for correcting me. Hybrid Haven, where a majority of our hybrids are housed. That's, uh, they get that entire board. So you can really see, uh, for example, how uh, intricate some of their diets are as well. So AJ, what's going on, mister? You're doing uh, some food prep for Caesar and Logan. I know they got half of their diet this morning and we're gonna do this special live post. So here's the other half for them now. Yep, so we got, uh, they are fed half of this morning and we, we uh, just cut some chicken in half for them uh, so we can give the folks at home a little more to, uh, feeding to watch. Nice. Um, so we primarily feed them chicken or beef. Today's a chicken day. Um, so we got all our thighs out um, and I was just chopping them in half for, for the guys. Um, so we have, uh, I mean, chicken and beef mostly, pull it out of the fridge. Yeah, so obviously everybody knows about the big freezer that we got new last year. And so this is where you'll kind of bring in uh, some of the portions to start thawing, I imagine. And then also yep. the prepped buckets are right over here. Yep, so we pull uh, a day in advance. So the stuff that's in the fridge uh, right now will be pulled out later this afternoon to thaw the rest of the way on the table and then we go to the freezer to grab the next day's food and put it in the fridge that's right that's right um, so all the all the cats we also have supplemental vitamins for them uh, that's already on the chicken here um we have different different mixture for the big cats and little cats depending on what they need um and everything pretty much gets sorted into these colored buckets depending on what building they're in um and then all the buildings are split up on our diet board um, so in the morning, we can just kind of go by section of uh, prepping all the food that needs to get prepped. Nice, AJ. I'll let you throw that uh, in the old sink over there. I want to thank everyone for joining us today. You're watching the Wildcat Sanctuary. We're celebrating Tiger Thon happening now through October 1st, where your donations are tripled. Tripled. That's one, two, three, tripled. So you give now, and it'll have, it'll have three times the impact. I'm up here in our... Uh, prep room where the magic happens if you will this is where all the cats's meals are prepped for the day they've already finished prep because you guys come in at what time aj 7 a.m 7 a.m in the morning 7 a.m sharp and you guys are what do you think you know how many pounds of meat do you think you're prepping a day for the cats at tws uh, we probably go for about 350 to 400 pounds of food a day 350 to 400 pounds of food yeah. a day people so, and that's everywhere from Caesar and Logan, who are our biggest cats, all the way down to our hybrids, um, who are the little fellas. Um, yeah. You just need little chunks of boneless chickens. So. Yeah, that's always <laughs> something that just blows my mind, just how much these cats are, are consuming every day. It's absolutely incredible. Um, well, let's see here, AJ. We have their, their chicken here ready to go. Uh, I was mentioning that we were doing a little food prep here. We got to talk to AJ, and now, everyone... We are going to go run down to Feline Meadows and do some cooperative feeding with Caesar and Logan. Uh, caretaker Teresa is going to join us. And uh, yeah, we're going to call that part two of our live post. I'm going to end it right now because the uh, internet can get a little bit funky when we're driving over. But I'm going to encourage everyone just to stay right by your phone, your computer, your tablet, whatever. I'm going to go live in about three to five minutes. So hang tight, everyone. Our uh, part two of our tiger feeding post for Tigerthon will be uh, happening shortly. So we'll see you all in just one second. Oh, my God. 